The most important conversation is the one you have with yourself. You wake up with it, you walk around with it, you go to bed with it. Eventually, you act on it. Sometimes you act on it good, sometimes bad. You got to change the internal dialogue. That person in your head that's talking that to you, until you change the internal dialogue in your head, until you callous over the victim's mentality that the world is out to get you because of you are the only, you got to change that shit, man. I get that mentality. I once had that mentality that no one understands what the fuck I'm going through. And if you keep that mentality, you're going to stay in the same exact spot that you're in. So when people get this mentality of like, you don't understand me, you can throw a rock to someone that can understand you if they're willing to break themselves down and stop hiding. Mm -hmm. A lot of people understand you, mm -hmm. but you got to stop hiding. And that's why I tell people, a lot of people are going through shit. They just hide better than you did. That's all they did. They're just hiding better. Not getting civilized is about having a savage mentality. Civilized is something where people, um, it's, a, it's, it's a comfortable world. A lot of us say, you know, like for instance, I see these athletes right now who retire, you know, I'm 38, you know, I'm 39. I did 20 years at the top of my game and I'm chilling out now. You see them a year later and how they look. What the hell just happened to you, dude? What the hell? You're one of the greatest athletes of all time. Kids looked up to you. Women, men of all ages looked up to you. And they hit the pinnacle where it's time to retire and their mind says, I'm civilized. The worst thing that could ever happen to any human being is they become civilized. It's that total accountability. Like even when you retire, you're looking at me and judging me right now, man. I was the baddest person to ever live. It doesn't go away, man. You got to wake up. Even though you retired, you never retired. You're setting the example every single day of your life. And being civilized feels so good. I'm sorry, man. Once you get to the top, you may retire, but you ain't never coming back home, man. Because now you're judged. People see you falling off. You want to be that guy who knows I may be retired, from the sport or forever I did, but I'd be damned if you ever see me looking like shit, feeling like shit, not arriving. People, I've arrived. I've arrived mentality. You're always setting the example. Civilization feels so good. These comfortable feelings are what people want. They want retirement. They want that, they need that. They, it's a, it's a yearning feeling. I want it too. People love putting a label on me about, my God, man, you're just wired different. Wired different, dude. I'm thinking right now, after I got past my stuttering thing, now I'm on a roll, I'm good now. You know what I'm thinking about right now? I'll wake up tomorrow and do the same shit again. I'm constantly callousing over my victim's mentality that I once had growing up. Every day you have to do this shit. Because why? When you stop doing it, you don't just maintain it. If you stop shooting a gun, you're not going to be a great shot if you pick a gun up a year from now. The only way to keep from getting rusty, you got to keep challenging it every day. Listen to me when I tell you this. External circumstances do not dictate the ultimate destination of your life. It's an internal game. You and your faith, your God are what will control the direction of your life, not the external things that are impacting you all the time. And this identity is that internal thermostat. It sets the temperature, just like a thermostat sitting on the wall, of the conditions of your entire life. The thing I'm most obsessed about that I know is gonna get me to the ultimate version of me is constantly elevating the temperature in the areas that matter to me, adjusting that thermostat, setting higher and higher and higher and higher so that I can get those conditions to match it because it always will. You will always get your thermostat setting, always in your life.